Those rising oil prices are affecting one industry that relies almost exclusively on petroleum-based products, dry cleaning. And now your local cleaner may be forced to pass those higher costs on to you. From the chemicals used to clean your clothes to the plastic bags that cover them, products made from oil are taking this store, well, to the cleaners, forcing them to charge customers more. Back in March, we took, we took an 8% price increase, uh, and we hope to hold the line there for a year or so. Other dry cleaners say they too may be forced to raise prices. It's a ripple effect that starts here at the supplier. Kenny Dillon of Fabriclean says first he had to charge up to $20 more for every case of wire hangers because of a government tariff on Chinese imports. Now he's had to hike his price on plastic bags by $6 a roll. Next are the cleaning solvents. There's been increases on that over the last couple of months also. They're probably two to three hundred dollars higher this time than they were about this time last year. The dry cleaners then take those higher costs back to the store where they must also fuel a boiler and water heater. An average gas bill for us is going to run anywhere from twenty three to twenty eight hundred dollars a month for just one location to run. From that central cleaning facility, Parker must transport the clothes to and from 11 other stores in Wichita and Augusta. A lot of our business is uh, pick up and delivery routes, so we have trucks going everywhere all day long. Costing him another $2,500 in gas every month. Add it all up and these extra expenses really cut into profits. But dry cleaners know if they raise prices, customers may cut them out of their budget. Business owners fear people will simply wait longer to dry clean their clothes or will only wear things they can launder at home. Not always considered a luxury, Mark, but mm. I guess in this day and age, even a gallon of milk seems like a luxury. Yeah, absolutely. Ooh, $4 a gallon anymore. Uh -huh. Well, 